Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Sarah. In this video, I'm going to be doing a magnetic eyeliner and lash review. I am on a hunt for the best a magnetic liner. So if you're interested in that, let's get to it. All right, in this video, I'm going to be doing a review of Bisutang Magnetic Eyelashes and Eyeliner. So, I hope I'm uh, pronouncing that correctly. So, let's try it. I'm going to open it up and see what we get up in here. I will put prices down below. I am on the hunt for the perfect magnetic lashes and liner. So, I have a bunch of reviews for magnetic liners and magnetic eyelashes coming up all right so this one comes with a little card it says that it is 12 month shelf life cruelty free uh high quality fiber 100 percent handmade magnetic eyelashes fit for all eye sizes ultra soft and lightweight you may even forget you're wearing it 3d magnetic eyelashes no glue avoid glue allergy easy to clean with proper use and storage our magnetic eyelashes can be used many times shake the eyeliner for 10 to 20 times and that is important uh, apply the magnetic eyeliner to the eyelids and wait one to two minutes to completely dry out absorb the magnetic eyelashes into the eyeliner with tweezer or hand to complete the wear and then how to remove gently remove your magnetic eyelashes by grabbing the outer corner and slowly pulling away from your lash line remove the eyeliner by using your makeup remover just swipe the cotton pads along your magnetic eyeliner and watch it easily come off um, I wouldn't personally pull it off like that because I would be scared that I would pull my actual lashes off. So, yeah, I don't know about that. So let's go ahead and open her up. It comes with what one? Two. It comes with what ten lashes at the front. So this is what it looks like. And then when you open the box up, it comes with this. This it comes with scissors to trim them cute little scissors, a magnetic liner, like this, just has an eye on there, there's nothing really on there, and then it comes with this cute little container, it feels plastic, it's really cute, it's got like plastic cover in it. little ACML action going on um, and then when you open it up oh super cute it comes with another liner and then two other lashes so the mirror looks foggy so it's not a real mirror unless it has like a plastic covering over it which it doesn't feel like so um, it seems like the mirror is fake so what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab one of these lashes so these have really tiny magnets. I'm going to show you a close-up. So that's what that looks like. It has really tiny magnets. I hope you can see it. Usually, like, some of them have, like, real chunky magnets. But this one is really tiny magnets on there. It looks like one, two, three, four, five magnets. And I am definitely going to trim these lashes. I'm going to use their little um, scissors and I'm going to go to that fourth magnet and I will stick into the scissors and I will cut that whole thing. All right, so I made them really short because I want to just put them on the outside of my lashes. All right, so it says let's shake this 20 times. So we go shake it. So I don't know. I haven't been on in so long. Um, I had took a little break because my mom had open heart surgery. It's hard for me to talk about, but 
she's doing good she's doing great so she did phenomenal she's back home everything's good but that's why i took my little break and i have so much stuff piled up i have to keep just keep going i gotta keep going so after i shook it i'm going to Ooh, it looks a little chunky let me try it on my hand okay it's very dried up and chunky but we're gonna try it so I'm trying it on my hand first let's try the other one that they gave me and see if it's the same way it might be that one we'll see no it's really chunky like oh my god this one's even chunkier okay guys I don't know about this look at this oh gross <laughs> come on but we're gonna get it we going to review this though okay i can't use this one because this one's so chunked out i'm gonna have to use this one because i can't use that other mirror because it's fake i'm gonna use another smaller mirror so you hopefully you can see up in there i'm gonna try to do one eye first and it doesn't really have that was really the only directions it says trim lashes line eyes Allow to set for one to three minutes into slightly tacky. Click on the lashes and go. So, let's see. I'm just going to put it right over my other. my other liner I'm gonna put it right on top all right maybe I'll do the other one because you have to wait for three minutes for it to set so I mean I'm going to send a message to this company and tell them about the liner I will get back to you about that but just from the liner, I couldn't recommend this. I don't recommend the liner itself. Because it's so chunky. Just dried up. So I think I put a decent amount on there. I want to see if it actually sticks to my hand. Let's see. I like how they're not really stiff, the lashes themselves, they're really, you know, bendable, which I like. I hate when they're so stiff. So it's good. There's definitely a grip, look. Ah, definitely a grip. Alright, so let's go in and see if I could just pop these bad boys on. Because me and glue, like, we don't get along. We do not get along at all. So I'm going to use this little thing. And let's see the ultimate test. Let's go in. The lashes are really pretty. Actually, they're sticking. Oh my gosh. So, I don't know. Is the liner supposed to be like that? Maybe. All right, I'm going to go ahead and stick the other one on and see how that one works. They're actually sticking. I'm um, so... Like, I did not think they was going to stick because of the liner. Holy... The 
this is so much easier to me than a damn glue. They're actually super pretty. But this is them on. Actually so pretty. So I am going to have to give them a good wear test and I will update y'all in the description box. But this is the end of the review. I hope y'all enjoyed. And I do have a bunch of these reviews coming your way. So make sure you hit that bell for any future uploads. Until next time, y'all stay blessed, guys.